Hello guys, this is your girl Lynn of Lynn Makeover. I'm a professional makeup artist and a content creator. So today on my vlog, I want uh, I want us to talk about Mrs. Gliss, the Nigeria gospel singer. I want us to talk about her marriage, her uh, his proposal, and everything. But before then, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Uh, turn on your notification bell and share. Okay. So, I came across a lot of uh, hateful, like, comments about their marriage, the way that his wife dresses and all of that. Please, can we let people be? Can we let people do whatever they like? or they laugh and be responsible for their actions. You don't force your lifestyle down anybody's throat. Your wedding day or your big day, you may love to look uh, sophisticated. You may love to look good, your makeup on point, your hair on point. But please, another person won't like it like that. Don't forget, all fingers are not equal. What I may like, Somebody may not like, and personally, I don't see anything wrong with what the lady was wearing and all of that. I think it's very simple. The hair, it's simple. It is not everybody. I, I'm sure if it comes to affording of those hairs, like the frontal, those uh, corsets and all of that, I bet you they have the money. This is Moses Bliss wife we are talking about. Of course, they have the money to do all of that. But no, the lady wants to be simple. From the time that he engaged the lady and saw the videos on social, I knew this lady was just a simple girl. And on her big day, she was not going to do much. For me, I knew, I knew that. I didn't place my hope so high that she was going to dress lay frontal and all of that please if you have the money or you are that type of person you are good to go you can do it you can do it but please the comment some of the comments like i was sad like going through uh, some people would be like eh, is, is this the big day or they are re they are rehearsing for the big day how can you like some like we are human beings what, what kind of lifestyle is this we should let people be oh we should let people be i don't do this but see going through the comments on social media especially ig and i came across a lot of comments i said let me do this video let me just tell you that what you may like some like everybody with their priorities on your big day for you your priority is your corset dress your frontal your makeup everything should be on point that's fine it's, it's totally accepted. But then again, on my big day, I may love to look simple. Probably just an eyebrow, no false lashes. Just me looking very simple. For my husband to be, because at the end of the day, I'm getting married. I don't have to prove. What am I proving to? Like, who am I proving that um, this is me, blah, blah. Oh, at the end of the day, I've gotten a husband. I'm, this is my big day. I just have to look simple. For my husband to be not to please anybody. Not to please anybody. In our society these days, like the pressure from people are making people take up a lot of loans to get married. And five years down the marriage, they'll keep paying just because I want to please social media. I want to please uh, uh, people on IG, Facebook, TikTok, and all of that. Let, let's just let people be. Let people be. Honestly, the comments, some of the comments. I really am called for like, no, no. Hey, some people are even comparing some of the uh, wedding guests to the bride that they've taken, they've taken her shine. Hello, this is her big deal. No matter how sophisticated you, you, you think you've dressed, you cannot shine the bride on her big deal. That one dear, like all the attention is on the bride. Let's, let's, at the end of the day, let's just let people be, do whatever they like, and, and be responsible for their action. Personally, I, I don't think there is nothing wrong with what 
uh, both the groom and the bride were wearing. You know that, like Moses Bliss is more like, um, I don't know, I don't want to say pastor, but he's a gospel musician, and we don't expect Moses Bliss to go and take probably a slave queen, in quotes, a slave queen. No, I don't think so. So all this thing I'm seeing on social media, for me, it's, it's not new to me because if you follow them from, the, um, from Moses Bliss YouTube page, the time that their uh, proposal video were out, the, the lady was simple, very beautiful, tall, Ghanaian, beautiful woman. What else do you guys want? At the end of the day, if this lady were to lay frontal, do a lot of makeup, dress anyhow, you people will still be on this internet and be saying that, oh, daughter of Zion is uh, looking somehow. Oh, daughter of Zion this, daughter of Zion that. Daughter of Zion this, daughter of... Now that the person decides to go simple, to portray her personality, you still have problem with that. What do you, tell me, what do you guys want? What? Oh, no, no, no. This social media can actually make and make people because, no. Emotional, like, psychologically, some of you are doing too much on social media, honestly. Because someone like me that, I know I have a tough skin, but some of the comments it got to me, even though I don't know her from Adams, but some of the comments I, I, it got to me, I was like, no way. After the marriage and probably going through social media and she came across all these comments, I don't think it's the best. At the end of the day, we are all human beings. We should learn to um, let people do whatever makes them happy. And we move. Anyways, anyways, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I know today I'm being too hard on, on you guys, but this is the truth. Like, honestly, if I don't, if I don't pour out this, I won't be free. We should just let the lady be you. At the end of the day, you that you're addressing Peche, you're addressing all of that. Did Moses, this came for you? No. At the end of the day, he went in for someone that portrayed his personality. So let's let us all chill. Congratulate them if you if you like. If you you don't want to congratulate them, just bypass. You don't you don't have to write anything if you don't have anything to write, actually. You don't have to write if you don't have anything positive to write under people's comments. You can even off your data, go off social media. If their marriage is over, you, you can come back. But we should just let people be. People are doing too much. But please, I beg you. <laughs> Subscribe to my channel eh? Eh? and turn off your notification bell. Until then, it's bye.